About 40 miles east of Klamath Falls, the Oregon Department of Transportation is working to fix a highway snag, working by digging into the past. ODOT calls it the Beatty Curve, but Native Americans have called it home for centuries. And before ODOT can fix the curve, we want to preserve the legacy. We found two shoes. One is probably an adult size, one's a bit much smaller. It's possible these shoe soles were worn out and discarded because they were too old to bother with taking away when the people left this house. It also might indicate that people left this house in something of a hurry. We're finding a lot of domestic items. Uh, most of them appear to have been manufactured between 1880 and perhaps 1910 or 1920. Another cut nail. The quality of the buttons we're finding, the quality of the cutlery is a little higher than I would have expected for a place. This wasn't really a rustic little cabin. I mean, this was somebody's home. This was, there were some cherished items here. The reason why this is so exciting and so interesting to us and to the people of Oregon is the fact that here in this shallow sediment that we're standing on is a record of what the people did day in and day out. We are finding stone tools mixed in with our nails and our porcelain and our window glass. We have projectile points that tell us that they're about 1,000 to, uh, to 2,000 years old. This is a resource. We try to recover what we can uh, while we're building our roads. Once we have bulldozed this, it will be gone forever. This is our responsibility to take care of the past, understand where we've been, and uh, hopefully be able to plot the future a little better by that. Running through an archaeological site, destroying an archaeological site, is like tearing a page out of a history book that we will never ever have access to. It's a real privilege to be able to be part of telling this important history. People have lived here in this place for thousands of years. Some of that story is written and most of it is not. And doing archeology span is the way that we are able to access that story. Every archeological site has a story to tell. And in this case, this is a site that has many stories to tell. So ODOT takes its obligation to protect the sites very seriously.